Sources. Sources. Targamas will no longer be a part of the initial roster of Excel Esports for Spring Split. Excel as well uh, don't have um, an academy as far as I know. They don't have an academy. A limit will be the new Excel Esports support for the LEC. So the main thing, the, 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 like my view of Targamas, obviously we don't have the full context of either G2 or, of course, his um, a most recent team, Excel. We don't have the context. But the fact that he was a part of two dysfunctional bot lanes is quite telling, you know? It, it doesn't give us the full story, but G2's bot lane was definitely a problem. And they couldn't play Lushanami, they couldn't play Yumi. It was hard to tell if Lakad is the problem or Targamas is the problem. Then moving into Excel. Patrick and Targamas was a very dysfunctional bot lane too. And, you know, from the little pieces of information we have on the outside, it's not a great look for Targamas. And once again, I say this with having very little context. In my mind, right, uh, Targamas is a player that uh, hasn't been super, super exciting for me to watch. I think that every time we did the research and preparation for G2, we could easily kind of establish the patterns that Targamos would play around, uh, which is not a great thing when you're playing against a support. It's like we, we, we could establish patterns and use that against him uh, when it came to playing together with his team. And uh, so in my mind, I don't think that, um, you know, Targamos in my mind as a competitor isn't a super interesting player, right? Uh, someone mentioned to me to check Targamas' tweet. Let's check it out. Okay. I don't know what this means. Now, Targamas seems to be, like, mechanically decent, but I'm not so sure how to judge him as a, like, leader. I don't know what this means. I, I don't know why people want me to check out this tweet. I'm not watching One Piece. So we shall see. Yeah. Either way, I I wish him the best of luck. I think that, uh, you know, the pickup of Limit, I think is a decent pickup. I think considering the market of Supers right now, it's like, you know, you have Limit, you have like Camellius, you have like some other names I'm not going to mention because I'm going to see keep it secret a little bit. And, um, you know, some people mention treats, but yeah, I, I think Limit is a decent pickup. I think that he got a bad rep for his time on BDS that he just got thrown into there and he was put in a very awkward situation. Like, keep in mind, like his situation was giga awkward. Like... They didn't realize that they couldn't have a certain amount of LSE players playing an academy and Limit was like in, in, in limbo. Like he was put in a very awkward spot. And the last time we saw him play full time, I think that he was a very dangerous player. Like I remember like Limit Alistar was something like a force to be um, forced to be reckoned with. Um, and I think that either way, this Excel also need to make change, and I think Limit is a fine change. Uh, I think that my, my last memory of Limit was, was a good one, and I don't think we should judge him for the situation he was thrown into with BDS, because that was a very tough situation. Like, BDS fucked up, and they didn't know how many uh, LEC players they could have in Academy, and that was a very big problem. So, I think all in all, I think Limit is a decent player. I think he, he's a player that you can definitely pick up. So I think this is a move in the right direction, right? It's like the main thing when you are making changes mid-season and you're in a position where you need to make changes, you kind of need to look at all of your options and all of the rules, right? And this could just be Targamas being a victim of circumstance uh, where, oh, they have supports available that can play uh, in the bot side. Uh, that could be decent, right? So we shall see. I think I think also Limit and Patrick seem to be a way better fit 
uh, at least in my mind, right? I think that what Limit wants to play kind of makes sense with the Kalista and the Draven and the Varus. I think that's where Patrick has looked uh, at his best in his uh, in his history. So I think this is a uh, I think this is good. A huge L, like like these people are completely clueless, you know. It's like you 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 know right away that it's either G two fans or K Cop fans that are like writing, you know. This one, let's see, G two fan, G two fan. This is a Carmine Corp fan because he's writing French. K Corp. K Corp. K Corp. K Corp. K Corp. Okay, here's a take. It is what it is. You know? But the Gamas in G2 played really good? I don't think so. I disagree. That might be harsh, but I disagree. I, I like I think Targamas played well enough to be on in LEC. But Targamas was also a part of a very dysfunctional bot lane. G2's biggest weakness was G2. Nah, like I don't mean to flame cake of fans, right? I think it's very national, a natural. Any team that has any team that has a lot of fans will have some deserving fans too. Yeah, and K-Cop, he was really good. But the level's also a lot lower, right? 